Let's be honest, setting goals at the beginning of the year is easy, but sticking to them, not so easy. That's why this year I'm finally doing something different. Instead of scribbling vague resolutions in a notebook that I'll forget in a week, I'm building a vision board with the help from AI. It's fast, visual, and a good way to keep me motivated. So whether you're planning a career leap or you just wanna feel more grounded heading into 2026, this tool makes your roadmap this year real. Let me show you how I built it and how you can turn one AI draft into a clean, motivating roadmap for your year. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. I'm inside Vengage and I just opened the AI vision board generator. I'll have this link below in the description so you can try it out for yourself. So I'm going to begin by pasting this prompt. It says vision board personal slash career roadmap 2026, four to six milestones, milestone icons, short affirmations, brand palette, high contrast, and bold headline. Now, before we generate this, I just want to show you that there is a ton of vision board templates as well. If you want to explore those, you can always use those and bring them directly into the editor. Now let's go ahead and generate this and I'll come back to you in the editor. Okay. So I got my generation back. And as you can see, Vengage built an entire vision board layout for me. We have photos, we have stickers, icons, textures, everything. I really love this corkboard design. And as you can see, we got a board with a mix of lifestyle visuals, work-related images, and little affirmation tags like be picky who you invest your time with. And it's not whether you get knocked down, it's whether you get up. And then we also have our milestones. So this is a really great starting point, but now we're going to shape it into something that actually reflects my 2026 goals. So let's start by customizing the milestones. So the first thing I'm going to do is rename the milestone titles to match the specific goals I'm working towards. So instead of generic affirmations, I'm going to go ahead and replace these with launch my first digital product make this a little bit larger and then i'm going to say build a consistent wellness routine make this a little bit larger i'm going to add speak at an industry event and then for my last one i'll do reach 100k community members okay so these will act as your roadmap. These are going to be short, visible statements that you'll actually reference throughout the year. So now what we're gonna do is add some icons that align with these to reinforce each milestone. So what we could do is go to AI tools and I'm gonna go to generate icons. For the speak at an industry event, I can generate a microphone and I'm just gonna do it in the monotone style. You have all these different styles to choose from and go ahead and start generating that. I'll get back about four different variations and then I can choose from those. Okay, so I got some back. I like this one, I think this one is cool. So let's go ahead and place that right here. And then for wellness, I can do a heart and I'll keep it in the monotone style so it matches the rest of my vision board. Okay, I like this one. Let's go ahead and add this to this area over here. We can put it at the top of this image maybe rotate it a little. And then for the last one, let's do a rocket ship for my launch, my first digital product area. Okay, awesome. I think this one's pretty fun. So let's go ahead and add this. Okay, sweet. So now we have some icons. These small visuals make each milestone easier to scan. So now let's go ahead and tighten up these affirmations. I do like the two affirmations that we have on here, but I'm going to use improved text to make it shorter. So let's go ahead and click that. And then I can easily replace this section. Be selective with your time. I like that. And then now I can make it a little bit larger. And then same for this one. We have these quick little options we can choose from, but you could also prompt it with natural language. Let's go ahead. It's not about falling, but rising. That's awesome. Can make this a little bit larger now. Okay, great. I like them shorter because it's easier to read on a vision board and it also keeps it more clean. It's not super text heavy. Now what we're going to do is apply our brand palette. So I'm gonna go over here on the left-hand side to brand kit and I'm going to go and use my bright brand kit. So what I can do is shuffle through this palette until I find a color scheme that I like. Honestly, that first go looked pretty good. So I can go ahead and keep that. 
And then I can go ahead and apply all of my fonts as well. So we'll add this, and then we can add for our paragraphs, the Robo Condensed. Also keep in mind here, there's a ton of palettes if you do not have your own brain palette, or if you wanna switch it up, you can view all of these different color palettes that they have as well as font pairing. So this is super helpful. Okay, so now I have my own vibe to it, right? This feels more like me. What I'm going to do now is run the design feedback. So I'm gonna go back to AI tools and go to AI designer. And what I'm going to do is ask it to suggest any design feedback for my vision board. It's going to analyze my requests and it's going to review the layout of everything. This will check the spacing, it'll check hierarchy, and it'll also check alignment. All right, so I got my feedback. I have a couple notes here. Unify your imagery, create a more cohesive theme by using photos that share a similar warm, bright, and motivational tone make goals more powerful, try phrasing them as affirmations. For example, changing, launch my first digital product to, I will launch my first digital product in 2025. I love that because I am declaring that it'll happen. So I can go ahead and update this. I will launch my first digital product. Then I can adjust the spacing behind this. Okay, that looks great. Unify the icon styles using a single consistent style for all icons, like a modern outline will create a cleaner look. Agreed, you can tell that I have some different types of styles of icons, so I could go in and adjust that. And introduce like a new color palette, applying a color theme with energetic colors like gold, cream, and terracotta would instantly refresh the design. So you can apply any of this feedback however you see fit, but this is a super helpful tool to have. Now what we're gonna do is go to file and then go to accessibility and check the accessibility. What this is going to do is make sure that the contrast is strong enough for printing or sharing for this design. I'm gonna go ahead and check this design. My text size, a couple of these failed, so let's go ahead and take a look at them. We need them to be at least 16 pixels, so I can go ahead and increase that one. And then same for this one. And then I can adjust them a little bit so they fit better. Okay, and then now I am passing my text size. And it also is letting me know that my text has sufficient color contrast. This is super helpful to run, especially if you're printing this in a larger scale. So once everything looks good, let's go ahead and close all of this out. And I'm going to export this as a PNG up here at the top. What I could do is either print this or I can also set it as my desktop background. So I am referencing it every single day. So let's go ahead and download this. And here is my final board. I have a clean, motivating, and highly personal 2026 roadmap that I can look at every single day to stay aligned with what matters this year. So if you've ever started a vision board and never finished it, this tool makes it unbelievably easy. You go from, I kind of know my goals, to here's my entire year visually mapped out in just a couple minutes. Try it out inside of Engage and let me know what your top milestone for 2026 is. And if you want more walkthroughs like this one, make sure you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss when we post new videos. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.